Hey, what's up guys? Andy here, and today we are reviewing over Boruto episode 156, titled, I Can't Stay in My Slim Form. Now, before we get into all that, I do want to say this is my first time recording over one of these anime reviews with OBS, so it might be a little bit off, it might be a little bit weird. Hopefully everything turns out well. If y'all will let me know in the comments down below, that'd be much appreciated, because I kind of want to do this from now on, because it kind of gives me more of an interactive feel with everything, but... I'm just not too sure about it yet, you know what I mean? Like, uh, it seems like it's gonna work, but I don't know if it's gonna work. But with that being said, we have another Chocho episode here, and I, you know how I feel about Chocho. I, I think she's an alright character, but she gets so much screen time compared to the other characters, it's like not even fair. Like, I'm starting to wonder if maybe like the Japanese audience like has like her as like one of their favorites or something, I'm not sure. But with that being said, guys, we have a lot of stuff to talk about. Really weird getting used to looking into a camera. I haven't done a camera video on my face in a good while. It's been a hot minute. But hopefully everything turns out well, guys. And if y'all do enjoy, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And we got some stuff to talk about. This isn't going to be a long video today. It's just kind of... What can you say? It, it was a Chocho filler, but we do only have one more filler before the Kara arc. At least the comments are saying that anyway. So hopefully, it's going to be good. I'm really looking forward to the Kara arc. Everybody's been saying, like, that's where Boruto picks up. That's where it gets good. You know what I mean? So yeah, I mean, I, I've said I mean a hundred times here. Let's just get into the video. If y'all do enjoy, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Like I said, it really does help the channel out a lot. And let's just jump right into it. So we start the episode off with Choji basically trying to teach Chocho the butterfly mode because the one she's been using, it, it works, but it's not really all there. It's She doesn't put her full force behind it, and that's why she can always retain kind of like her normal mode as soon as she's done with it. And they pretty much determine that she just has nothing that she's thinking about when she's doing it. Like Choji said, he wants to protect people when he does it. But then we cut into our intro and title card here. I can't stay in my slim form. Now, this I really love this intro. I don't know why. Like, I, I really need to look this up. Because, like, I have a weird obsession with this intro. Every time it comes on, I can just catch myself bobbing my head. And I'm like, wait a minute. Hold on. And then I'm like, oh, wait, no. Yeah, <laughs> let's get it. Just from, like, the opening lines. It's really cool. But anyway, let's move past that. So, Choji and uh, Chocho are basically just eating when Anko runs up. And she's like, don't you have to meet Shikamaru? And he's like, oh, I forgot. So he runs off. And then Anko and Chocho are basically going to eat some of the rice, or the rice pudding, the sweet bean pudding here. Or not pudding. What is this shit called? Sweet bean soup, I think? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, it's sweet bean. That's all you need to know, okay? And basically, they're out of sweet beans here. And there has been bandits who have been stealing the Azuki beans, which are what they used to make it. So, of course, you know, Chocho is pissed, Al Anko is pissed, and, you know, Anko was a character I actually enjoyed in the original Naruto. I mean, we didn't get to see her a lot, but she was cool, you know, she kind of had that mystique vibe, and she used the snakes, and it's kind of like the Mitsuki vibe I get now, you know? But yeah, so uh, they're basically going to go after the thieves here, and they run after them, and they end up finding them, and I'm not a fan of this at all, because... They do this a lot in Boruto. They make the old characters, unless your name is Naruto or Sasuke, you're kind of a weakling. You know what I mean? Like, don't get me wrong, none of these characters were great, but they made Anko look completely useless here. She she shot an attack. She didn't even hit anybody. She got captured here. Chocho saved her. And then she just got destroyed by this dude. And this dude's just like a low-life bandit, you know? I mean, he knows lightning style and he has a cool whip, but like... Come on now, you know what I mean? But then Cho Cho goes into her butterfly mode here to protect, and I was really scared they were going to do this. And she wants to protect the beans so she can go into butterfly mode. <sighs> I don't know, man. It's 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 Borto. I love Borto to death, but like, it's just little moments like this. Like, she should be wanting to protect something else, but I guess it's her character. You know, they all develop their own way. We move into basically. Chocho saved the beans, 
and the bandits are still up on top of the mountain, the mountain, the mountain, and Chocho pretty much saved the beans here, but Anko is trapped behind a boulder, and she can't get back in her regular form because she don't have enough calories. She used the actual butterfly jutsu here, so it doesn't just work to where she can just revert to normal like she used to. So, we cut into the bad guys coming down as Chocho's trying to eat to regain her calories here, and basically, she can't fight. Now, I think it would be, I think it would have been cool if they would have actually did it to where she, like, learned how to maneuver around in her slim form, but it, it's, you know, it's whatever. It was, a, it was a good little episode about this stuff, like, to where she wants to learn to protect stuff and to learn how to use the jutsu, and, you know, I, what can you do? Either way here, she runs away because she's not full healed yet, and she goes and eats, and then she comes back, and she gets captured. So, this lightning dude, I guess he's not all terrible, but he starts putting voltages in her, and she starts thinking, she's like, I, I, I gotta want to protect something. She had a flashback of Choji here saying, you know, I do it to protect my friends in the village and stuff like that. And that's when she pops out this. And she goes, this won't work on me, you got that? And this was actually a really cool moment. Like, as much as I'm not a huge fan of Chocho... Cho okay, Reddit, thank you. Anyway, as not as I, I'm not a huge fan of Chocho Cho just because she gets more screen time than other characters. But, like, this was a cool moment. Like, this was good, you know? She got the feels good moment. She wants to protect Anko. She wants to protect the beans, protect everybody, and catch the bandits, the thieves. So she goes into this butterfly mode and just walks the floor with these guys. I went, I went, <laughs> I went back. See, I'm, I'm still getting used to this OBS stuff, guys. But yeah, she, she basically saves the day here and she goes in and she, she gets Anko back. And then they all go and eat some soup and her and Choji are talking and it was a good little scene. But that was the end of the episode. So there's not a lot to talk about in it, but like... It was a good little filler episode. I mean, it would have been cool to see another character. Like, I love Shikadai. I mean, he's had a lot of shining moments. But, like, I love Shikadai. It'd be cool to see an episode about him. And Sarada. Like, we haven't seen much of her at all. Like, we've got a few Mitsuki episodes. Boruto's the main character, so we get to see him enough. But, like, Inogen, I think, has had one, which... Okay, cool. Uh, but his was kind of mixed in with Himiwari's, but... Sarada, I don't think we've got an episode with her, have we? Like a fill, like a filler, you know, like not an actual like manga episode. But like Sarada would be cool to see. I would love to just get another Mitsuki one. I love his character, Shikadai, Inogen. Um, there's so many kids. Like e even the girls, they've got the three. The girl, I think, are they team? Uh, fuck, I don't remember what team they are. I think they're twelve or ten something. No, this is team ten. <laughs> I don't know. Team something, the three girls, the president, and then the cat girl, and uh, the sound girl. I can't remember their names. Don't at me, bro. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Uh, they get their own episodes and stuff, but, like, it would just be cool to see a character get some shine, too, because Chocho's literally had, like, four of them at this point. But, yeah. I mean, with that being said, I'm not hating on the episode. I thought it was a good little pastime. I enjoyed it. Looking forward to the car arc and looking forward to figuring out this whole OBS thing because I'm garbage at it, as you can tell. I've looked down a hundred times to see where my hotkey is to go to the next slide, but yeah, with that being said, yeah, you know, I said with that being said, a hundred times. I just repeat myself at this point because I'm getting caught up trying to look at the camera, look at my notes, look at the keyboard. It's all over the place. I hope it gets better, but if y'all did enjoy, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all next time. Peace out. This is our identity.